In this video we are going to present some of the capability of our framework. The generality of the whole body controller allows us to use different kind of robots. For example, in this first simulation, we are controlling the quadruped robot animal on flat terrain doing a crawl gate. The framework allows us to easily formulate new gates and instantaneously change them online. Here you can see animal doing a trot gate. The main advantage of the approach is that it requires no planning for the center of mass, and no state estimation. Thanks to the whole body formulation, it is possible to have motion decoupling capabilities. For example changing the role of the base orientation while trotting. The framework allows us to easily formulate new gates and instantaneously change them online. Here you can see animal doing a trot gate. Controlling the height. And changing the pitch. Thanks to the walking pattern generator it is possible to perform omnidirectional walking that involve also pure lateral motions. In this second simulation, we are going to show a walk on rough terrain with high cue. A robust stance is achieved thanks to the postural task while the haptic touchdown prevents injection of undesired forces. The robot is able to trot on rough terrain while controlling its orientation. Thanks to the generality of the whole body controller it is easy to switch gates according to the terrain difficulty. This can be useful when walking on rough terrain because it allows the robot to be more adaptable. For example, when the roughness of the terrain increases, a crawl is better than a trot to keep locomotion stability. In this video we show simulations of the robot walking with an arm on top, tele operated by the user. We show that the robot is able to achieve successful locomotion even with the arm completely extended forward. This shows that the lack of a specific plan for the center of mass is not an issue if the weight of the arm is small with respect to the robot 1. Preliminary experiments have been carried out with the HiQ robot platform. Here you can see HiQ trotting on flat terrain. In this video we control the orientation of HiQ by setting commands with a joy pad. Here we show the disturbance rejection capabilities of the approach. 